Direct Print supports advanced finishing features for most printers. You'll need the PPD file, the Postscript Printer Description file, for the make and model of the printer that you want to enable advanced features for. You upload the PPD file under the Advanced Settings section of directprint.io. When you enter the Advanced Settings section, you'll see that there's an option to upload a third-party PPD. Go into this section, locate your PPD. In this case, this is a, P a Postscript Printer Description file for a Canon IRC5030. As soon as you click OK, this will upload the PPD file to the platform, and you'll see that all of the advanced finishing options for this printer are listed on the screen in front of you. At this point, as an administrator, you have a choice whether you want to force or delegate the options. If you force an option, it will mean that it is always applied. So in this case, I could force stapling um, uh, for on, on one staple uh, for all of my users on, on, this, on this printer. Or alternatively, you can delegate the option to the end user. By delegating, it will actually present the option to the user under the advanced print uh, sections uh, on, the, on the client so that your end users can select on a per print basis whether they want to enable, for example, staple or hole punching. So I'm, in this case, I'm going to delegate both stapling and hole punching to my end users. That's all saved out, but I will click the back button to come back to this screen here. I'm also going on the client side, I'm going to force it to pick up the changes. Your changes will automatically propagate uh, through the system. It'll take a maximum of 20, 25 minutes to pick up the configuration changes for all of your clients on the network. In this case, I've actually forced the configuration change. I'm now going to go and print a sample document using my Canon. So this is the standard print journey for anybody on Chrome. In fact, if I click under see more, you'll see the printer listed here. This is my Canon IR Advance. And then under the advanced sections setting and advanced settings section, you'll see that I have both the option to staple and hole punch. These are the two options that I have decided to delegate down to the end user. And of course, as an end user, I can select whether I want to enable stapling or hole punching. I can click apply, apply, click print, and then I'm into the standard Chrome print journey.